In this video, I will show you how to construct an oblique circle. In this example, we'll be using a 50 diameter circle. So the first thing you need to do is you construct or you draw the 50 diameter circle. Next is divide half of the circle vertically um, into equal parts. In this example, we have 25 radius. So 25 radius, we can easily divide it equally into five parts. That will give us five millimeter each. So divide it vertically and then draw the lines. So we, need, we only need to divide it or we only need half of it divided right after you divide it equally into five parts let's draw our oblique square the measurement for our oblique square will be the same as the diameter of our circle which is 50 so we need to draw an oblique square which is 50 on all sides right after you draw the square the oblique square you also need to um, have the half, I mean the center horizontal line on the oblique square. We also need to divide it equally into parts. Now this time we will divide it equally into 10 parts because from the circle that we divided into 5 parts, that was only half of the circle. So right now this square is the full um, 50 diameter so you need to divide it into 10 equal parts so the same thing it'll be five millimeters for every part um, you draw the vertical lines once you're done dividing the square into 10 equal parts you have to go back to the circle like how I showed you here you take the distance from the center horizontal line center horizontal line of the circle and then from there so the first line from the left you take the distance from the center to the point on the circle then you take that one on the oblique square mark the points every time you take it from the circle that's all you have to do you have to you have to repeat that from all the lines that you have from the circle and then you do that on the oblique square Now remember the distances from the line, from the second line that you've taken it from and to the other side of the circle will be the same distance. So that's why we only divided half of the circle because on the other side of the circle, or I mean on the other half, it will have the same distance. I know this is not accurate when I drew this, when I constructed this on paper but I want you to get the idea of how to actually construct the oblique circle. So you're just taking points from the circle and then taking it to your oblique square. And then after that, when you have all the points on the square, you have to do freehand sketching, okay? So you have to draw the, the curves and then connect the dots by basically it's connecting the dots the the points that you have on the square you have to draw arcs from that 
so you have to do it freehand so that's how you construct an oblique circle using this method and then since our coursework will have half a circle so it's just half of of the construction that you need to do so i hope this helps you email me if you have questions